What is geography? Let's look at some examples of some different things you could study in geography. Which places in the British Isles receive the most rainfall and why? How are clouds formed and why do you get mist, especially in the mornings? And does it make a difference if you're at the top of a hill or close to the sea? How are rocks on the top of a hill broken down? What range of species would you find in an area of wet moorland like this? How are streams formed and how long does it take for the water level to rise after it rains? What happens in a river under the water? And why does a river get deeper and wider the further downstream you go? Why is some farmland less fertile than farmland in other areas? Why do you get a range of material on a riverbank? And then here's what the sound. All these little bits of sand. How does the land use change on a river like the Thames? How are bays formed on coasts like here on the south coast of England? How do waves erode rock? And how do different rocks erode or do they all erode the same? Uh, this vehicle, that's what they call an MCUD. How does training for the military affect rural areas like here in Dorset? It's actually a British gun. Left That's what they call a 105 millimetre gun. What are the most popular tourist destinations within the British Isles and why? What other countries do British holiday makers visit and what do they do there? In British cities, What's the difference between shops found in the centre of a city and shops found towards the edge of a city? How is a central indoor shopping centre an advantage in a city like Inverness in Scotland? How can materials for construction of houses have an impact on the environment? Why would someone design a house using solar panels and a turf roof? The north side of the building. When generating power, does solar have advantages over nuclear or over wind? If you have a wind farm, what is the impact on the environment and on the people? Are there ways of managing waste in ways which are friendly to the environment? I know, it's like this giant restaurant. <laughs> what tourist activities are offered in a major city like London? <laughs> Where are the main places of work located in a major city like London? Where can people living in cities get exercise and enjoy green spaces? Why is traffic congestion a problem in a major city like London? And how does it affect people living and working there? People use the public spaces in a city like London. How 
How does the microclimate change from place to place in a city? Why did areas of a city like London develop in the way they have developed?